Six Day War by Nyan and Henny. The Six Day War, also known as the 1967 Arab Israeli War, or the June War, was a war that was fought between Israel and Jordan, Syria, and Egypt. Back then, those three countries were known as the United Arab Republic. Helping them in this fight was Iraq, Saudi Arabia, and Lebanon. The war started on June 5th, 1967, and the war ended on June 10th, 1967. Israel had won the war, and they captured the Golan Heights, the West Bank, East Jerusalem, the Gaza Strip, and Sinai Peninsula. Months prior to the start of the war, there was high tension between Israel and UAR. Syria had shot at the innocent Israeli tractor that was in the demilitarized zone. Then, Egypt announced a blockade of Israel's access to the Red Sea, which was international waters. Israel had considered this an act of war, and they launched a surprise attack called Operation Focus, which was basically a massive airstrike that destroyed most of Egypt's air force on the ground. The UAR retaliated, and the war went on from there. The war started on June 5, 1967, at 7.45 a.m. By the final day, Syria had lost about 100 combat aircrafts, and the fighting had stopped. On June 10, a United Nations brokered ceasefire took effect, and the Six-Day War ended abruptly. The United Nations True Supervision Organization, also known as the UNTSO, had initially been a part of the Armistice Agreements of 1949 between Israel and Egypt, Lebanon, and Syria. The UNTSO helped peacekeep in the Middle East, investigated complaints by all parties, and they made regular reports to the UN Security Council, also known as the UNSC. After the unexpected Six-Day War, the UNTSO had an important role of helping establish the ceasefire agreements to create new boundaries between the countries. Then, the UN Security Council added some additions to the UNTSO Charter, which within the first few months of the 1967 ceasefire. Mainly, the observation posts were the important factor in the addition of the UNTSO Charter. The United Nations is an organization aiming to maintain international peace and security. 242 Security Council, Arab states accept Israel's right to live in peace within secure and recognizable boundaries, free from treats or acts of force. Each of the Arab states eventually accepted it. Egypt and Jordan accepted the resolution from the outside. The International Criminal Court is a jurisdiction to prosecute individuals for the international crimes of genocide. War crimes have been committed in West Bank, including East Jerusalem and Gaza. Children unlawfully killed by Israel forces. Occupied Pakistanians territory and is delmented by the decremation line agreed in 1947 armistice which is known as the Green Line. The state of Pakistan it cedes to the ICC statue on the 2nd of January 2015 and accepted the 1st of January 2015.